Hello everyone, I'm here to introduce you to making biodiesel from, you guessed it, animal waste fats from the slaughter process. So here are some of my pigs, which we're going to make fuel out of. There's some extra fat from beef and pork being dumped into the grinder at the butcher shop. And here we are grinding that fat up into little morsels for the rendering process. Um, pictured here is the kettle we had made to render down that volume of fat, which ended up being about 600 pounds of ground pork and beef fat. Um, here's our kettle mixing at the end of the rendering process. Once the rendering was finished, we followed our manual to prepare the chemicals needed to initiate and catalyze the reaction. And at the same time, we started filtering out and preparing our feedstock for the final transfer into the reactor. Um, there ended up being a lot of meat in the feedstock, so we bypassed the filter first to get the meat out of the oil and then uh, we started transferring it into the BioPro 190 which is our reactor. Now we're adding the chemicals to the BioPro 190. This is KOH, potassium hydroxide that we're adding. pumping the methanol into the machine prior to initiating the reaction. It's good to have two people for that stage. The methanol is added into two different ports in the machine. And the sight glass on the side of the machine is useful to determine the exact quantity of methanol that's added. Once the chemical agents have been added, we tell the machine that we want to start the reaction. We failed to record a rather important step here, but we had already added sulfuric acid to the reactor. After 24 hours, the glycerin has separated to the bottom of the tank and we're able to remove it with gravity into these five gallon containers. The last container had a little diesel come out, which lets me know that I've gotten all the glycerin out of the tank. The next step is to wash the finished biodiesel. And to do that, we add warm water and a little bit of vinegar um, to the input side of the tank and the or excuse me the reactor and the reactor will draw in that water uh, as it's needed. It's also pumping out that water after it's washed the diesel the blue barrel with the grease on it was the uh, the output side of the machine. Inside we have a paddle mixer doing the work of agitating the diesel and water so it can be cleaned. And that's how you make biodiesel.